Snake scales are composed of the protein keratin, which is largely impermeable to the passage of water. Although the permeability of snake skin can vary over the course of a habitat and also over the course of a year. The scales uh, occur in a deeper layer and an outer layer, and before shedding skin, lipids accumulate between these two layers, making it easier for the outer layer to be shed. The skin is usually shed entire, with a snake beginning by rubbing its head. The pigments which determine the color of a snake are in the dermis, which is why the shed outer layer of skin lacks uh, pigment. Some snakes have iridescent uh, pigments. In rattlesnakes, the remains of thickened skin, which are not lost when the skin is shed, begin to accumulate, and at each shedding, another is added to the rattle. The rattles of young snakes have fewer um, beads in them than those of older rattlesnakes. While many snakes have coloration, uh, which allows them to camouflage themselves in their environment, some poisonous snakes, such as coral snakes, have warning coloration to uh, encourage would-be predators to learn to avoid them. Some harmless snakes, which are not poisonous, um, have evolved similar coloration patterns because predators then avoid them as well. So there are mimics among the harmless colubrid snakes, which look very similar to the poisonous coral snakes. Some scales are modified, such as those which are broader and flattened in the head for protection. Some snakes have modified scales which can appear as, air, as eyelashes or perhaps even having a hairy appearance. The number of scales, such as those on the ventral side of the body, can vary greatly.